Were you surprised that this announcement or decision, whatever, came when it did in June and not later? Or? You know, um, I think Coach was just happy that, you know, when I was in the weight room, I, I was doing everything that I've been doing before, and that it was signs that I was healthy. So I think it was just depending on, you know, once I was healthy, he was going to make the decision. So. To, uh, to the extent that you are throwing and not doing the organized stuff, but, but you are throwing a bit, how, how are you throwing? In what ways are you throwing? Sort of um, to what you're doing with well I don't want to divulge too much into it but I am out there I'm throwing you know I'm just doing the program and getting better one day at a time just healing up so you feel feel good. yeah yes sir in terms of how much farther you are progression wise and comfortably with the offense is it you know a full 180 or, or what do you think you are from where we were last you know you know there at the end I thought we were you know we clicked you know Iowa State game was a pretty good game and, you know we were we were clicking guys around started coming around like Mario and you know it, having the spring off um, you know you would think it hurt but I got to see the game this offense from a different point of view how the coaches see it and now I know more about like what they want on the field so I think that helped me and how much easier does it make it to practice knowing that the entire team has one quarterback to look at and to be able to practice with instead of kind of wondering you know which guy's gonna get the nod oh it's huge you know they know who to look to I'm more comfortable I don't have to worry about that I can focus on my game getting the team better and not worrying about you know oh is he gonna make the decision you know it's, it's, it's huge um, and, you know, I was worried, you know, all of us were worried in the in camp last year. We all wanted to win it. And, um, maybe we worried about that too much instead of getting ourselves and the team better. And, you know, we won't have that problem this year. So. Clint, one of the things sometimes last season that seemed off was communication between yourself and Dane on the sidelines. This spring, being able to sit out, being able to sit with them, did that really help out? Yeah, I was, I would, whenever Dana would signal it in, I would stand behind the play. I'd do, I mean, I, I was out there. As far as that was concerned, I was signaling to the guys. I was doing everything like that. I obviously wasn't running the plays, but as far as that part, you know, I got that down. So. How hard do you think that's going to be to be able to translate down the field once you get into live action? We're, you know, you know, live action. It's, you know, it's always going to change. But you know, when we're out there and we're doing seven on stuff, it seems all right. So, this offense produces a lot of good quarterbacks. And uh, I'd like to be. I obviously wasn't one of them last year, and I'd like to be one of them this year. Um, numbers wise, wins wise, you know everything. Um, so hopefully I can get better. I'd like to stay healthy. That's one of the you know main keys. But um, you just gotta trust the offense, trust the coaches, and you know it speaks for itself. Do you feel more comfortable now? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, being out for spring, um, you know, with the communication definitely helped, and that was probably one of our bigger things. You know, it was communication and staying healthy, and you know I'm getting those two down now. So hopefully we'll be be pretty good. In the discussion with. Uh, Coach Holgerson and Shannon, when did they exactly tell you or give you the indication they might announce before? That, that, I mean, the day that he, he was like, hey, I'm going to do it. I'm like, all right. So, <laughs> you know, it was, it was uh, you know, very relaxed, laid back. It wasn't like a big, you know, it was just like, hey, you know, we, I think we want the team. You, you've been a good leader since this whole time and continue to do it, and they're going to follow you. So, Have you talked to Paul and Schuyler and all of them about it yet? Or? No, I mean, it was, you know, it's kind of one of those things that, well, I'm not gonna like rub it in the face or anything. I'm just, it's just one of those things. It's just like, you know, understood. And, you know, like last year, they named Paul to start at the beginning and, you know, things changed and hopefully it won't this year. But, uh, you know, I, they gotta be ready at all times. You know, all of them, um, even the young guys. And that's just how it is. Clint, would you address the frustration last year of coming home and then not being able because of injury to be yourself to, to play up to what you what you can play yeah it, um, it like I said it is part of the game you know um, people do have to play injured but you know knowing like shoot the one time I was healthy we weren't that bad you know we pulled off a pretty good one and then the rest of the time it, it wasn't you know um, it's definitely frustrating and you wonder what if but it's you know that's life you wonder what if on a lot of things you're not gonna get anywhere so you just got to go out there and produce. You got to play healthy. People do it all the time, and I, I didn't produce last year. And you know, if that happens this year, I hope, I, hopefully, I will. What are you really looking to improve on this season? Wins. You know, that's you know, that's I, I come to win. If I throw five picks and I still win, I'm happy. If both five touchdowns we lose, I'm not happy. You know, I want to win some games. 
Um, that's all I've been about. You know, I'm not about me at all. You know, I just want to win some games. So. Clint, is the extra time you're able to spend with coaches in the summer really helping in your development and being able to recover a little bit more? I wish we would have had that last year when I came <laughs> in. You know, it kind of threw me in the fire August 1 and didn't really know what was going on. But, yeah, definitely it uh, it helps, especially the new guys like Skyler and Will. They're, you know, they're, you know, when we go out there and do seven on, they know what to look for. Last year I was kind of like a chicken with my head cut off running around. And, um, but you know that's just the way. It's just the way it is sometimes. So. Clint, you come in last year and all the way through the fifth week of the season, every week is a competition for the, the spot. How much do you have to keep that mentality now, despite the fact that there's a news release that says you're the starter? You got to fight like you're not. You know, it's. You know, I'm a big time Brady guy. You know, I watched Brady six. I've seen it 30 times, and it's. You know, he has the mentality is like, I don't want anyone to think they can do the job better than me. I don't want anyone to think that, and so I don't want to give anyone the chance. And that's what I, that's my mentality. I don't want anyone to have the chance to do something better than me. I want to be out there. I want to play. Um, I'm always competing. You know, competing in anything golf. You know, me and Cody Cody Clay play tennis. You know, I'm the most competitive tennis player out there. So. Very competitive, and uh, you know that's, that translates on the field, and you gotta compete at all times. At the same time, uh, getting the majority of the reps and, and having people look at you as the starter, that's gotta help to a great extent, I would think. How much does that kind of change the way you can approach day to day because you know that you know you're approaching it as the starter? Yeah, that, that's your job. You know, it helps a lot of things. It helps you know the actual execution of plays because you are getting the reps. It helps your confidence because you know you're getting the reps. You know you're the guy. All the guys know it. You know, it helps their confidence to know that. You know, it it it's so it is vital, um, and that's one of the things we didn't have last year and until the fifth game of the year. And um, but it, it definitely is key.